The German Shepherd is one of the most popular dog breeds in the world, but few people know about the history of this medium to large sized dog, a result of the genetic programming of one of the most important dog breeds of its time. The creation of the German Shepherd is both a tale of coincidence and hard work. This very talented dog is capable of doing anything from herding, guard dogging, and police dog work and warfare to even assisting those with disabilities. So, in today's video, we're going to follow the story of this strong and intelligent breed, starting from its humble beginnings in Europe before it made its way all around the world, guarding and protecting everyone they know, while also being the most loyal companions. Sit back and relax as we walk you through the history of the German Shepherd. Search for the perfect sheepdog. A decent place to begin this tale would be the late 19th century Germany, with wild animals such as foxes, wolves, and bears looking to have their way with the sheep grazing in the fields. The local farmers sought to breed dogs that would not only protect their livestock from these wild predators, but would help to herd them. Before we continue, make sure to check the links in the description. We found the best deals for online dog training, dog supplies, pet insurance, and more. What are you waiting for? Searching for dogs with qualities such as intelligence, strength, and speed, the farmers bred several local breeds around the nation, but none of them showed the perfect combination of the features mentioned. Even the formation of the Phalanx Society didn't help solve this issue, as some members were more concerned with the appearance of the dog than its work purpose, meaning that they were not getting any closer to making the breed they desired. To add more problems to the goals, the industrialization of Germany also brought about the major eradication of the predators these farmers were trying to protect their flock from, and this delivered another blow to the creation of the German Shepherd. Max von Stefanitz At the end of the 19th century, Max von Stefanitz, an ex-military man and a former veterinary student and a former member of the Felix Society, continued his research for the perfect sheepdog. He coincidentally came across what he wanted when he came across the dog, Hector, at a dog show. A result of several generations of selective breeding, Hector was everything that von Stefanitz thought the perfect working dog should be, and was so impressed by its strength and intelligence that he immediately purchased him and changed his name to Horand von Grafoth, before establishing the Verein für Deutsch Schafferhund Society for German Shepherd Dogs. As the first member of the aforementioned society, Horand was bred along with other dogs from Thuringia, Franconia, and Württemberg. Basically, any and all dogs, with suitable traits to create the perfect working dog. As a result, many puppies were born to this original. And over time, many of the German Shepherds today became linked to Beowulf, one of Horan's puppies. Service Dog Following the creation of this perfect sheepdog, it must have come as no surprise to many when German Shepherds joined the German military service, thanks to its wolf-like appearance which made it very popular during the Nazi era. Even more so, before becoming the Fuhrer, Hitler and a German shepherd named Prinz, whose loyalty to him convinced him to include them in his nefarious mission. Apart from helping the Nazis with their mission, German shepherds were there during Hitler's final days, and with his trusty blondie being one to test cyanide capsules before Hitler and Eva Braun took the easy way out. Post-World War II Following this, the German Shepherd was spread all over the world, and although it had to overcome the stigma of being associated with the Nazi machine, it has now become one of the most beloved dog breeds in the world, using its intelligence, speed, power, and energy to protect those it knows and loves with fierce loyalty. It's all thanks to the words of Max von Stefanitz that we have one of the best guard dogs and companions you could ever have. With that, our video has come to an end here. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more pets and dog-related content. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Until then, goodbye.